kids, it's time to play Jeopardy for the Nintendo Entertainment System. So let's do it, right? Let's uh let's get it on. Okay? This is a game that I played fairly substantially when I was small. Wee! Playing the skip. When I was small and now I'm playing this turn the music down a little bit. It's hard to uh so now I'm going to play it here. This is sort of a test thing to see if this uh works or if this equipment is slightly too rudimentary. Uh you can hear the totally sweet NES rendition of the Jeopardy theme song, which is certainly... Oh, forget it. Let's just uh, go here. This is a game I have played fairly extensively in multiplayer when I was uh, small, or even not so small, necessarily. Um, so I'm going to know some of the answers, probably, but I don't know. It always sort of keeps you going, especially when I put it on a hard mode, because we rarely played on a, the ultimate hard mode, so a lot of these are certainly going to be new, so. Versus the computer, yes. Otherwise, there is no point. So, what's my name? How many letters again? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six letters. Uh, now I could just call myself GeoX, but that's kind of boring. So instead, my name here is Bad Bug, which is a reference that some people might get if they know lame old NES game show ports. If not, not. Look, forget it. I'm just going to be called Bad Bug, and that's all it's going to be. Now we can set the totally sweet uh, character portraits there. Don't you uh, dig that? Look at this. Uh, there's, a, there's a bunch of guys, and they all look completely uh, batty. And as you can see, they have different skin tones, including this uh, alien skin tone. I mean, maybe it's meant to be uh, oriental or something. I can only <laughs> guess, but I really couldn't. Uh, and yeah, I mean, they have all sorts of uh, ethnicities here. Wow. Uh, I'm going to be this sort of satanic-looking uh, fellow here, right? Versus Marty. And, of course, Hazel. Man, this is going to be a uh, one for the record. You know, I'm usually okay at uh, Jeopardy, except that I always get overconfident slash cocky, and so I lose. What can I say? Well, I could win, but I just won't. Anyway, okay, we're going to start off with folk songs of 60s, right? He left New Christy Mint, New Edition, First Edition is now one of the, I have no, no gosh darn clue, but Hazel is all about the 60s folk singers, Kenny Rogers. You know, I would never in a million years have gotten that, I have to tell you. Gosh darn you, Hazel, eh, eh, bleh, child only. This film rating means all ages admit it. Ooh, ooh, I know, call on me, Alex, call on me. Now, the good thing about this, well, I don't know if it's a good thing here, is that you can enter random gibberish after you've entered the right uh, answer. And it'll be cool. It's all good. G is the uh, greatest. It's the greatest. Gosh darn it. The greatest uh, letter. I always feel like you should get bonus credit. You want to get bonus points for... Uh, Entering all this bonus stuff, you know, because you're just providing extra information. Sort of more value for the listeners at home. But, oddly enough, this doesn't seem to be the way it goes. God darn it. Oh yeah! Bad bug! Bad bug in the house! Um, I'm not going to spend a heck of a lot of time doing that here. This is something that we did a lot of in multiplayer, and it's pretty darned amusing for the easily amused. Which may or may not be you, but, well, you know, whatever. I'm just not interested in... Okay, I always go for the top things first, because uh, this sports program is now required to accept... Little League? I don't know. I wasn't even paying... Shit! I should have uh, been paying attention instead of just, uh, you know, babbling all this time. Then I could have gotten Little League, and happiness happiness would have reigned over the land. Now frickin' Hazel's uh, back in charge. Old... Ooh, ooh, ooh! I know! I know! <laughs> I really feel like it would be better if contestants would, uh, had to, like, do the ooh, ooh, I know thing instead of just, uh, um, just the boring old buzzing in, ooh, buzzing in, duh, that's so exciting. Nobody could come up with that one. Jeez, oh yeah, oh yeah, bad bug is now back. Okay, world flags, let's do some world flags, shall we? Flag of this simulation, ooh, 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 I know the answer, I know the answer! And no, I hadn't seen this or anything before, so I mean, I just sort of skim-read these things and sort of can, uh, can, you know, get them without, uh, necessarily paying a lot of attention to, uh, what's going on. Damn bad bug is, uh, 
Don't bug us kicking some ass, taking some names, you know, the usual kind of stuff that you do when you're a bad bug. Their star features are a star, a hammer, and a sickle. You know, this was back when uh, the USSR still existed, right? So, uh, uh, what is the USSR? Of course, the fact that there's a the there kind of uh, gives you a pretty substantial hint. Anyway, uh, do, 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 do. Ah, uh, these fly. We're gonna have to do them all eventually. Unlike right now, Pete's sake. Notice the quotation marks, as Alex would uh, hopefully. Two of the biggest hits are Puff the Magic. Ooh, 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 ooh. Get it? See, Pete, right. Uh, geez, this is a sort of long thing to enter. But you know, you get used to it, and it's not a Peter, Paul. I guess who the other one is. I'm gonna use this Amber Sand here. I'm kicking it with the Amber Sand. Uh, oh yeah. Peter, Paul, and Mary. And me. Well, whatever. Whatever. The point is, I got points, and Hazel will be crushed like the bug she is. Pete's sick. He's the commissioner of the... I'm supposed to know who the commissioner of the national NFL was in, like, the freaking early 90s or something, you know? And I just don't. There's just no getting around it. I have no gosh darn Pete Rizal. That doesn't ring any bells whatsoever. So, it just wasn't happening. Sorry, people. It's just the... Wait, is Pete Sick? He was TV's Columbo. Oh yeah, Marty, look at that fascist fist pump here. Peter Falk. God damn you, Marty, what the hell? Urgh, what are you shaking your fist at Hazel for? Uh, Soup Song, Rocky Comedian, his friends are... Ooh, you know, I... The thing about this version is you can, uh... Log in even when you don't really know, per se, the answer, because a lot of the time it's sort of... It's sort of one of these things that is something that's in the back of your mind. You don't even know what this is, per se, except for the fact that it's called Soup Song. Makes me think, hey, Soupy Sales. Who or what is Soupy? Is this even there? I don't know. I could be thinking of something completely different. But, you know, whatever. I was right. See, you know, I got it. I would have probably been too timid to do that in the actual show. But I wasn't on the actual show. So I just, uh, I just kicked some ass, took some names and like that. Artists and Meg Campbell, Soup Cans, Pop Art, whatever. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, I mean, some of these are... I mean, this is a $500 question. I mean, what the hell is, hell is the deal with that? And this is the hard difficulty setting. I mean, come on here. Come on here, people. You've got to kick it up a notch if you really want to challenge us here. If you want to challenge the greatness of bad bug here. Okay. Do, 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 do. Soup song. Let's just do it. Phrase means from the very beginning to the very end. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, call on me. Call on me. Call on me, or you will regret it for the rest of your mortal life, which won't be very long, because I will, from Soup to Soup 2, the exciting sequel to Soup, which is, uh, anyway, from Soup to Nuts. I feel like there's some, well, I don't know. Who cares? Mark Twain. We're an expert in Mark Twain, aren't we? Sure we are. When is history of the jungle? You know, I know this story, but I totally can't call the full name to mind, so I'm afraid I'm not going to get any dollars here, tragically. <clears throat> Calvarist, no, I wouldn't have, uh, would not have gotten that, tragically. Mark Twain. Mark Twain. Oh, yeah. This cooner played the Connecticut, uh, Dean Martin? I... I... <laughs> sort of close to kind of being in the right ballpark. Gosh darn you, Hazel! I didn't say you could have money. What is this? This is a lie. This is a pernicious Creole favorite. Ah, uh, is it gumbo, right? It must be gumbo. It has to be gumbo. Gumbo's like soup, right? And is it... Maybe it's jambalaya. Look, I don't know. All I know is gumbo's easier to spell. And besides, it's only 200 bucks. Oh yeah, gumbo, gumbo, gumbo! Oh, oh, gumbo! Oh, oh! Oh, oh, okay. Sorry about this. Mark's kind of... Oh, 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 I love them. That, the, bleh. Mark's, well, actually, a lot of Mark's Brothers films are kind of lame, but, uh, Duck Soup is definitely pretty much an all-time cinematic. Oh, plus, of course, it's Duck Soup. What else could it be? This is the soup category. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I'm crushing the competition. But we'll see how long that uh, keeps up once I get a daily double. Oh, 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 oh. Because, you know, when I get a daily double, what happens is I feel sort of obliged to make it a true daily double, as they dramatically 
in tone because I always mock the people in the actual show for not doing that. So I feel like I've got to sort of put my money where my mouth is and then, you know, mostly that's when I don't know. I mean, I know sort of most of them, but that's generally when I don't know. So I lose. And it is 